it easy can have a good time you know uh -huh. so maybe they missed out here possibly they have a better plan in action yeah. here but nonetheless we are gonna go with the game 30 seconds in definitely uh -huh. gonna be secure here for the purple and um yep yeah. oh yeah. look at this look at that oh, invade my. wow this is this is a sneaky invade from the super rookie here Flap TZ na uh, right now trying to get the orange. I think Timian Mar they don't. No, they did nothing, no. That's nothing, that's a freebie. Yeah. Nothing. They did not know it was a surprise. Team Philippines. Flap TZ with a sneaky orange steal, and it will delay the carries farm. You know what, uh, Leo? One thing to take note with the Masha oh. against the carry. The Masha has the disarm mechanic. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, so like yeah. the the oh, carry will be yeah the carry will be forced out to to disengage because of that so wow well, team philippines here like playing fast pace mm -hmm. oh nice arrow here by rebo jumping on the hiccup got a trap underneath him gets away just barely mm -hmm. and oh, still okay. this Love just it. shows oh, that team philippines so is on the aggressive here oh bk throw another perfect match inside. catches uh -huh. out a couple there uh, only lost the inside much. might be the downfall of our tank here for team philippines and that's gonna be first blood going to yellow flash there you go there you have it that is the power of the atlas initi initiation and the atlas slow nice pick up there from Ye Le yellow flash show um leo it will even up the economy because even though he, he didn't he did not got uh did not get his uh orange bob at least he had one kill so it with this i think team Myanmar. It, it's now a time for them to like push up a lane and then hope for the best to get another pick off because right now looking at the minimap it seems like team philippines they're, they're taking control of the minimum equilibrium because of this masha pick as well mm -hmm. and again mm -hmm. there are a few things that the masha can do that the lulux cannot so in the early yes. game here we're gonna see more of that and i think that is what team philippines needs not exactly sure what uh, their roadmap is to victory right now, but uh, I can say that they're at least doing well for themselves here. Being ahead about 3,000, oh, 300 gold. Now another fight picked here by Few. Yeah. Yellow Flash uh -huh. put at half health. Hold it up, Few popping the Inferno here. Not much DK can do. They can try yeah. to secure this uh, Little Wanderer though. Sam, Sam, Sam. It's the Little Wanderer dance. Just want to get it. There you go. You got it though. Oh. Yeah, if you got it, that is the, the site there, but the perfect you match and the flicker. Let's what? see if they can catch Few. Lusty, there you go. The rage is real, Few. Surviving the potential death. Wow. Just for the little wonder. This is how Team Philippines is. They don't want to give Team Myanmar every, uh, a, a chance to like get gold, Leo. And with this, Team Philippines, look at this. Flap easy with another sneaky orange take in the bottom side Man, the way you the way you call him the super rookie it's all the more being true like you are just writing the story and we are all a witness to how you're writing it and rebo throwing out an arrow to protect himself and still like the way that the team philippines uh, are playing like there's very little punish that team Myanmar is doing well because again, uh, I think Team Philippines, they, they are aware that Team Myanmar ha has the better 5-on-5 five -five draft. Like, sure. they have the better late game, all-in Royal Rumble type mm -hmm. of uh, play style. Mm -hmm. But what, we're, what they're doing right now is they're, they're confusing them all throughout the map. I think you have traps, so that means you have Vision. You have the Masha, which is so fast, and you have a a, a Hayabusa. So there you there you go. Whoa, the, the Splash Brothers are in town. Ooh, the Teasy Brothers, the Teasy the Brothers, the Teasy Brothers, <laughs> the Teasy Brothers, showing up in the bottom lane. Wow, oh, you know the what? child I've... prodigies, bro. Yeah. Five minutes in, uh, they're, they're they're very smart about it. They are dis uh, they're they're disincentivizing uh, the five v fives, and now they want another fight here. Oh, what is this? There you go. Jump in here by Flapteezy. Oh no, that's Rebo going down. Yellow Flash gets a kill. That's a double though for Flapteezy. Royal Milk trying to push them back. They do not want this push to happen. Oh, from behind, Kaltizi goes in, takes down Yellow Flash. Oh my, Team Myanmar, they're slowly, they're, 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 they're like, they're slowly um, 
getting lost here in, in this game because you know what i think they want to like establish dominance in the early stages because of their tanky lineup plus they have huge ultimates too they have a wombo combo type of composition but man team philippines they're just they're just baiting out all of this specific skills and team Myanmar they cannot do anything you can just walk right? into that small bush and just ate everything from three members yes. of Team Philippines. Now there's another hiccup Ooh. dived in by Flapteasy. Royal Milk here being threatened. Shadow kill once more. It's round two for Count Easy. He gets his kill. It's a mega. Yellow Flash can't even protect his own purple. DK though, shutting down the Hayabusa. Flapteasy going down. Sam, Sam, Sam gets the kill. Now Lusty running for his life. I don't think he's going to make it. Down he goes. Yellow Flash takes it. <laughs> Now Yellow Flash uh, being safe here in uh, in this game. I think that was a little bit of a sour for uh, for Team Philippines. But you would sour. like, Pretty yeah. Sour. But actually, it's under understandable because again, with the with their lineup, they just want to keep the pressure going. They just mm -hmm. want to fight to and fight and fight and fight because again, Team Myanmar, if they scale in the late game, it's going to be hard for them to take them down because because uh, what's happening right now is Team Myanmar, they're spending so much uh, skills here like they're throwing off the last insanity, the fatal links and they, they're hitting nothing but germs because Team Philippines is just so, too mobile for Team Myanmar to hit them. Oh, for sure, for sure. And I think uh, what what also is going down here is uh, the fact that uh, we have to watch out for Yellow Flash. He's only died yes. once. Yes. He kills. If Team Philippines does not watch this, uh, this could get out of hand, right? But yeah. Um, yeah, immortality on Royal Milk saving him. Oh, Mangin, I actually thought this turret went down. This might be also key as to why Team Philippines got a little sour and paid for yep. it. Yep. Yep. The extra damage yeah, of, the the yeah, yeah. of the first hour. Yeah. Of the first hour. And I think uh, Team Myanmar, they will defend this, but Carl Tizi, hey, no way, I'm gonna get it. So there you go, Team Philippines, man, I think we were mistaken. Like, I think they really know how to play the Masha lineup. Like, mm -hmm. they just want to uh, be online every time, even though you don't have ultimates. Because sure. if you're gonna think about it, they don't need it for Team Philippines. They don't need their uh, wombo combos. All they need is their first skill and their second skill. The arrow, mm -hmm. the, the sight, the oh, inferno. DK. Oh, hey! Oh, Hiccup wow. going through. That is just a flurry of damage raining down upon Team Myanmar. And Sam 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 is lucky to not be a victim here. He's the only survivor of uh, that engagement. And my God, eight minutes in, Team Philippines bringing the thunder here. Down bottom, taken by few. Sham 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 needs to dance his way out of here. Manjin, we read oh the uh, draft. It was a it was a good draft by Team Myanmar, no question. Yep. But we did not uh, put into consideration how aggressive Team Philippines can play. You know what, dude? I think they br they they brought thunder and lightning because they're yeah, so both. fast here. Both, yeah, both. both of them. There you go. Ka -chow. So fast, man. I am child. Pleased. There you go. Team oh. Philippines, that was quick with a snap of the finger, getting DK, and DK, he is not okay as Team Philippines will now transition to the mid lane and all, and will pressure all of the lanes. Man, eight minutes in, who would have thought that this will happen, Leo? Who would have thunk, man? DK died here six times now. And I guess as an Atlas, you don't really feel like you're in any sort of trouble. Because again, you have additional damage reduction when you yep. go for the perfect match. But it yep. seems like Team Philippines has a different idea. They just want to rain down everything and yep. just essentially take advantage of DK feeling a little more invulnerable than he should. And yep, Flapteasy having his way with the turret up top. There's so much space here for Team Philippines. No more turrets, man. Just those protecting no the base. Yeah, and this is what we call the turbo masher. Uh, uh, what's scary with a masher lineup is that when you lose a team fight, it's like a Kimmy but melee. Because mm -hmm. they can quickly take down towers yeah. With, yeah. with just one hero. I even the Lord, there you oh go. Oh my god. Right now. Conversion rate through the roof. That is exactly Time it. what Masha Time brings it, bro. to the table. Um, yeah. I I'm counting five seconds, all right? So, you know what? Who doesn't matter because few joined in, so it would be inaccurate. But nonetheless, team fight waiting to happen up top. Uh, yeah. Down bottom, it's Carl Easy versus two members here. It's DK and Royal Milk. Wow, mm -hmm. they're just they're just managing the map here at this point. 
Yeah, man. Man, this is so sad for Team Myanmar. I really thought that they had the upper hand in the draft. But man, Team Philippines, it, it, I, I, I don't know, man. I'm not, a, I'm, I'm not like quite aware that probably this is the new strategy, because I think this is like a good substitute to the to the global presence, to the range of the of the Luyi. The fast yeah. pace heroes. Yeah, yeah, definitely. You have just heroes who are as mobile and able to convert mm -hmm. much, much faster. Now, yeah. uh, 10 minutes, 30 seconds in. Oh, Hiccup with a kill there. That is uh, with a death there coming in. Karthizi doing it for him. Lord is getting uh, his way with the turret. And that's another on Sham Sham Sham. Ooh. Royal Mill is doing his best here. At least the Lord is going to go down here next. But Yellow Flash, oh, he is just having a hard time. Yeah. Oh, my. Team Philippines, ladies and gentlemen, we're in a convincing fat fashion. They oh. will take down Team Myanmar 1 0 in game one. But nonetheless, here we go. It's do or die for Myanmar. They have the mm. chance here to make Team Philippines falter and make our group be a little more interesting. It's time for game two in the series of two Philippines versus Myanmar. And do you know what, Leo? Speaking of game two, it's time for round two for Plaptizi. Look at him oh, once again. again. This he's is the sequel. Yeah, this is the sequel, the orange buff. Yeah, right now in is, the top lane. This is Plaptizi stealing your buff, part two, electric boogaloo. And I wonder if he got it, because Sam, 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 take, uh, giving him quite the visit. Now DK looking low, can Lusty get him up? Oh, okay. wow. Plaptizi did not steal it. He doesn't have it on him. Yeah. Sam, 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 he protected the the buff, but look at how, like, smart Team Philippines is. After the failed attempt of Plaptizi, he immediately cleared the top lane, and Sam, 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 he was forced to react in the top lane. So with this, I think Team Yanmar, they're now starting up good. But, oh. as I say this, Team Philippines quickly with the first blood in the mid lane, surprising the support of Team Myanmar. There you go, first blood going over Team Philippines. They're up about, you know, like, is the Masha the way to go now? That's the question, but speaking of the way to go, Royal, Mick, Ro Royal Milk actually yeah. taking down Rebo, going, uh, going in, and that is a freebie coming in from Team Myanmar. Nice. Um, Nice kill there for uh, Royal Milk to at least even up the odds in the early stages. Yep, now Few might be next. He's looking low. Flicker out. Yellow Flash does not want any of this. Carl Tizi, ooh, look at that. Dropping in. Make <laughs> yeah, acrobatics in the bottom lane from uh, two of the cores uh, of Team Myanmar and Team Philippines. But ooh, look at the damage of uh, Hiccup there in the mid lane. Poking the Lunox, so we're gonna have another pause here, but it seems like Team Myanmar, they're now back in this game. They have finally uh, found their groove here, Leo, yep. with that kill, after that kill of Royal Milk. Yep, uh, that would have that was a better outcome. I mean, I was saying earlier that possibly Lusty was gonna go, but I think Rebo was better. And Rebo was the better target, to be honest, because that's the Lunox without the Order of Billions. Like, very rarely will you see the Lunox without her ult and in the early game that's one way to go about it at level three yeah i think we did not see it because the, the pause uh, the pause window was yeah in front of it so in yeah the way. it was in the way so yeah man i think uh, team myanmar uh um they're now getting their hopes up um uh, the, of the early stages because carl tz because of his hp he was forced to teleport back to yeah. the base so Recall. with that yeah, yeah. Uh, Team Myanmar, they took advantage. Hey, Carl TZ is he's low. He's now in the base. And after the kill, instant disengage. Nobody even bothered to, like, overextend for Team Myanmar. So this is good discipline coming out from this team. Speaking of discipline, Flap TZ. That was kind of greedy coming in from Flap. But meanwhile, we're going to have a fight here. And the purple side of Team Philippines, the rotation will... Oh, the, oh, the vacuum. The pull from the rotation. Nice pick up there for Team Myanmar. And Yellow Flash responding to the steal. Did he got it? Yes. Yes, he did. Ow. 
and he just walks away like nothing happened and called easy here only with his orange not much he can do here royal milk wants some does not let him have it hiccup here with the rotation gonna be pulling back in oh flap easy gets revenge onto royal milk and here's the portal by hiccup and the no veil it's fine that's still one for one uh i guess i'll take it yeah man i am <laughs> yellow flash an eye for an eye, my friend. You steal our buff, I will steal yours too. Delaying Carl Teasy. And with this, this is a scary Ayabuza right now. He even has the retribution. He did, he did not use it. Yeah, he, he just, just used the shurikens. For, just basics, yeah. yeah. Just the basic yeah. attack in the shuriken. And there you go. So you take my uh, purple. I'll take the turtle. Right, it rhymes. All right. All right. All right. Fair enough. Fair enough. Let's see here. It's an even ball game, ladies and gentlemen. At the four minutes of the game, Team Myanmar, they're trying their best to pick off Philippines one by one. Just like this, the shadow kill and the lockdown onto the bouncing ball of the Kupra. Team Myanmar now ahead with two kills, but Flap TZ working hard. The boy is working hard. Just pushing out towers. Hmm. All right. It looks like uh, the bottom lane has been worked on well by Flapteezy. Uh, he does not like the matchup against Sam Sham Sham. Like, you're, you're right, Manjin. That was such a disadvantage for the Masha. So he switches down bottom and starts working on that turret. And I guess that's yeah. the most that uh, Team Philippines has got. And they're down 2,000, man. And look at this, Sham Sham yeah. Sham, able to just cut the waves. He doesn't care. Yeah, man. Team, team Myanmar now... Uh playing it smart and what i like about them is they don't overextend uh what's interesting here because it's team philippines they're trying to get kills but meanwhile as i say this that is of course the ultimate coming in from carl Tizi. sham 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 pops the cotton inferno and he will survive no casualties whatsoever but look leo yellow flash or oh, uh, okay i was mistaken carl Tizi securing the purple there you go so it's still 50 50. Still 50-50, and it looks like Royal Milk here is in trouble. Carl TZ has eyes on him. Smart Missile is not going to be able to save you here, friend. Lusty with the jump in. Carl TZ gets the kill. And yeah, I think uh, Royal Milk will just off position here. Not oh, a my. good look. And Rebo able to use the Order of Billions to get away, but just barely. But this turret Channel is going to have to go. Soon. So far, man, Team Myanmar, two, zero, uh, two turrets to none for against Team Philippines. And yeah. Lusty is just here with the defense of his life. This is what you get with the P and K on DK. Then just call him DNK, you know. DK. Yeah, because what's happening is Team Philippines is trying to enter, but Koopa is just so irritating for their lineup, stunning them and negating them for getting kills. From getting kills, I mean. So with this, Team Myanmar, they're now controlling the mid side of the map because we, we uh, like, for for like five minutes, Team Philippines have been trying to get kills, but man, Team Myanmar is out sustaining them with this PNK. Yeah, for sure. The extra body on the map is such a nuisance. The Team Philippines that uh, even Carthese there had a, had some trouble trying to steal the uh, turtle despite using his ult already and having a retribution on deck. I'm, I'm guessing what happened there was he was bit down by Koopa. And again, yep. that's how well that uh, wolf slash dog comes into play. But again, <laughs> at least while that was happening, some uh, silver lining here to Team Philippines uh, early game is that yeah. Flapteezy was able to push at least until the second tier, tier turn. And they're now leaning towards the Masha, uh, Masha play style here. Mm, the split push. <laughs> The split push, the split push ML. There you have it, another initiation from Sham Sham Sham. The rotation won't connect, but the Koopa, the, the dog, man, it's it's acting as a meat shield here for uh, Team Myanmar. If Team Philippines, they can't they they can't initiate with something. Yep, they're having it. They're finding it hard to break the line. And man, yeah. the, the the first priority here for DK to pick up the all mask first. That just makes Team Philippines' job so much harder. Whoever yep. tries to go in will get stunned. Whoever DK chooses to stun will surely get stunned, right? It's, it's yep. that simple. Yep. Even though they don't get kills, like, right? Because the main plan is just to stop the aggression for mm -hmm. Team Philippines. Defense is the best offense. Meanwhile, Lusty uh, trying to escape, but the rotation pool 
will be there as Team Myanmar will now get another kill. You know what? It seems like Team Philippines, they were, they're trying to make plays after plays after plays. But Team Myanmar, they're just so defensive, in, they're defensive enough that they can actually outkill someone. Just, again, look at that. This is part five. Yep, yep. And again, this whole one for one line of play is not going to get Team Philippines out of this rut. They are down on their back foot, but I guess it was all just smoke and mirrors, a distraction, so that Carl TZ could find some breathing space and take that turtle down bottom. But ugh, I think they're going to lose out on this turret right here. Unless Carl TZ has something to say about it. There you go. Does he pop the Tempest? Yes, he does. On to a Sham Sham Sham. Lusty goes down first, but Yellow Flash taken out by Rebo. Sham 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 might be next here. He jumps away. Cutter in Inferno in tow. Down goes Carl TZ. Oh man, down goes Rebo as well. It's a three for one in favor of Team Myanmar. This is pandemic. Pandemonium. Pandemonium and DK is a okay for Team Myanmar. They're now chasing Masha, but the dog is now out. <laughs> DNK using DK using the PNK so well, and it's giving Team Myanmar the opportunity to take this game away for Team Philippines. What is the answer for Team PH, man? This is just too much. No, I think uh, the key here is, I don't know, I, I don't think you should fight fire with fire. You should not try to fight DK where he says he wants to fight, man, because he's just going to let the dog out. Who, 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 you know what I mean? Like, it's just so hard yeah. to, to face such uh, this terrible odds because the dog is getting tougher by the minute there's gonna be yep. more CC and Hiccup is there to just bring the, the the retaliation if they so pick a fight and now order billions here by Rebo just to get away and look at this DK he's found his next target Lusty Arr. there you go the, the dog is hungry bro uh, <laughs> Koopa is hungry Oh yeah. my, Team Philippines are trying to make a play another here, but here comes another ejector in the range! The time is was good, but the rotation vacuum was better! Team Myanmar, ladies and gentlemen, they're chasing down Team Philippines! And they're creating havoc, the dog is just too much! Yeah. The wolf in the night! Oh no! Oh man, call Edward Cullen. This werewolf needs taken care of. Yellow Flash, did you see the basics? Did you see how he was hitting that shadow kill? He was literally taking people's half uh, life bars. Every single hit. Now look at the items. Blade of Despair. He's uh -huh. building up to the endless battle. And he's got a, a Raptor Machete, which I believe is just maxed out on stacks. It's just gotta be, given how much damage he was dealing. Yep. Stick to the basics, says Yellow Flash. Basic no jutsu in the ninja way so 6 to 14 you know what leo uh, i think team myanmar they did well in answering oh. the link pick because right they, now they yeah. burst it down lusty there you go because right now i'm not really seeing any uh solutions here for carl tz to pick up one because you cannot kill anyone right now one on one if you are carl, carl tz so wow team myanmar this is this is actually a good lineup. Uh, we were mistaken. I was mistaken. Me too. To be honest, yeah. me too. But again, these two teams. Oh, I gotta say, Young on Galactico showing us that it's not just the draft, my friend. It's not yep. just the draft. So it's these two the teams, they, they deserve just as much as anybody to be in the playoffs. And this game right here is evidence of just that. Now. Yellow Flash, he seems to have unlocked the Jutsu. Whoever he talked to, man, the comeback Jutsu is real. And he's showing yep. us here, taking this Lord as early as 12 minutes. This has got to be it. Uh, it's so hard for the comeback to, 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 to happen. Team Philippines, that is. But if ever it's going to happen, I think it's going to come from Flapizi. It's got to be the split push. It's going to be. Because, uh, uh, man, um, Team, team Myanmar, because what are the options here for Carl TZ, right? You, you have a retribution, so that means you don't have a purify. So there's no like answer here for Carl to easy to prevent getting stunned. Because you have the rotation, you have an ejector, the Koopa can stun you, the the side can sometimes pull you. So man, Team Myanmar, they, they channel their inner chakra here. Yep, and yep. just summon something. And wow.
And now they summon the Lord, and the Lord is now marching towards, towards the, the mid. There you go, there's the ultimate coming in from Karth. Is, is this an outplay though? He actually killed the, the Hayabusa, but the Lord is going in in the mid tower. That is killing spree for DK again. He is letting the dog out, and the dog is barking. The dog is hungry. Few trying his best with the flamethrowers, but where's the damage? Nothing coming out from those flamethrowers, man. Team Myanmar. Uh, <laughs> Team Philippines have tried their best. I'll take that as a win for Team Philippines. They were able to yeah. shut down Yellow Flash. Because if it was anyone else but Yellow Flash that they took down, it, it would have been just disastrous. Now, Hiccup destroying Flap TZ. And there's the Tempest of Blades yeah. by Carl TZ. Oh, Hiccup Ooh. shut down here. And Rebo might bite it. Royal Milk with your Stumble Ooh. Force taking down the Lonox. And Royal Milk here once more. Can he get it? Not a good target, Few is. There's the Ejector onto Lusty. Oh, Last Insanity here by Few hitting two people exploding in their faces as DK just gets the basics in, man. Again, we're forgetting the fact that DK on that PNK is doing so much work. Ejector onto another. Lusty goes down. DK goes 4 0 and 13. Lucky number. Oh, my. DNK on the PNK made my day. Team Myanmar. Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> just punishing this um, pseudo greedy split push lineup of There's Team another. Philippines. There's another Manjin. They have penetrated <laughs> mid and they're not done. This team oh has my. extended so long, man. They've been here for what seems like five minutes now, and bottom is going to get it as well. Yellow Flash is back, by the way. That's how long the team fight lasted because Yellow yep. Flash is back. <laughs> <laughs> it's a whole dead timer. It's a whole dead timer of uh, of Yellow Flash. 21 to 8, man. Team Myanmar retaliating in this series. And they're not giving Team Philippines any chance of Ooh. a comeback Look potential. Not easy. Yeah, Caught not out. Easy. Oh. Yeah, the, again. Yeah, the, the, they're, they're doing their best here. And it, yeah. it really just shows that Team Philippines. They're, they're 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 holding on they're desperate yeah. and again they'll yeah. send the flap yeah. easy wherever he can find what could help them win and it just wasn't there he yeah. fell uh down two for one score on flap easy here and they've taken what several towers on the map no no, no shame in that but again they're they only have one turret left manjin and it looks like yeah. they want to go for it here team myanmar they're gonna go for their final siege this is, this is their ultimate defense here for Team Philippines. But look how tanky that dog is, Leo. He has the the dominance eyes, the, be, the, the thunder belt as well. So man, no one from Team Philippines can really like kill DK here. Zero deaths right now, even Sham Sham Sham. So wow, yes, is this the final siege, Leo? There you go. There's the ejector onto Pew. Pew just uh, oh. being the fate here for Team Philippines, but no, he will actually fall down. He will pop the immortality as Team Myanmar. They're now setting up for the top lane, and the Lord is free for the taking, Leo. Mm -hmm. Here's what's interesting. I think uh, after this little fight here, Kartizi with the Tempest of Blade trying to get out of here. This tower takers. Well, probably except for the Hayabusa, but as I say this, never mind that, because Team Myanmar, they're now inside the base and the tower in the top lane is now gone. Oh. Team Myanmar! Uh, they will now tie this series one to one. It's gonna be okay for PNK's.